New on the night team, a new bike lane along a busy highway is raising safety concerns tonight. We went to state officials for answers. And the night team's Brian Crandall is live in Plainville. That's right. He rode his bike on the lane to show us why there is concern. He had a helmet on. That's good to see. Brian? Well, Dan and Patrice, this is Route 1, and this is the new bike lane right here behind me. Traffic moves quickly behind it. Now, for reference, we're about five miles south of Gillette Stadium near the intersection of Interstate 495. Now, the new bike lane came as part of road improvements as part of the revamping of Plain Ridge Park Casino, but town leaders are calling it a safety hazard. One selectman telling me it's nuts, a tragedy waiting to happen. A beautiful evening for a bike ride. But on busy Route 1, a new bike lane pops up out of nowhere on the four-lane road in Plainville. No other bike lane leading to it. I had to cut across traffic to give it a try. One of the first things you notice is there's no one else on a bike who's out here riding along the highway. And then it goes for maybe like 500 feet and then just stops all of a sudden at this busy intersection with Route 152. That's the southbound side near the Target shopping plaza. Uh, and now I'm really wondering, where do I go from here? And town leaders are scratching their heads, too. It's just not a safe arrangement. I talked to Plainville Town Administrator Joseph Fernandez on the phone. I would love to have a conversation with anyone at Mass Highway or elsewhere who looks at that and thinks that it makes sense. The Massachusetts Department of Transportation tells us the bike lanes were put in pursuant to their guidelines for making bicycle accommodations. I think it's a policy that doesn't square with reality. So a similar situation here on the northbound side. The bike lane just starts at the busy intersection. You could turn into the new casino if you wanted to. That's why all this road work was done. Or you keep going straight toward I-495. All right, so this is the ramp to get on 495. I'm clearly not getting on there, though I never thought I'd be riding along Route 1 here either. So where does this go? Right here. Dead stop. This is the end of the line in the middle of a cloverleaf. All right, so the bike path to nowhere. The town administrator tells me he'd just like to see the bike lane lines painted over so it disappears. We're live in Plainville. Brian Crandall, NBC 10 News 19.